place again. Let's continue. Okay, what was that? Oh. Oh, can move here. <clears throat> okay, nothing here. get to the generator house in that case. High voltage. This looks awesome. This is just amazing. So I'm unable to cross the river from here. Um, perhaps there's another path. Wall mounted case, egg shaped discoloration. The axe. Nope. 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 Okay. Let's go find that axe. Have to move up here. Or is, or is there a house somewhere? I don't think so. But it definitely showed the floor of a house, didn't it? Nope, this isn't going anywhere. Is this a path? No. So those electricity lines, where are they leading to? Cable car of some sort. Let's investigate further down in this building. Ah, oh, it must be in, still in this building then. So, let's see. On the outside. Broken door. Is it? Oh, God. Here we are. No signs of struggle. Did he kill himself? Something taken? in his hand, right? No? Where could it be? A scissor. Oh, and it's in the, in, in the service elevator. Okay. Okay, good. So we're missing scissors. I'll just quickly put down the axe. go and where is that service elevator I see. oh here it is uh, 
Thank you. So he's... Hang on. Somebody who's hiding in here? Took his scissor. And then probably died. Okay. No. Okay, this one guy fleeing. Okay. Where did they come from? Here they, here they come from. Okay. Oh no, actually. He already has a Nax, but it's the other way around, so... Huh. This wasn't the one, because the Fire Axe is still in the building. Um, okay, five, he dies in the room. Four... I don't know if he chased them outside, but I guess we can give it a try. Okay. Because he is still carrying the axe from inside. What happened here? chooses vessels. Okay, that's completely wrong. But the other guy ends up dead. I mean... Chases him, chases him, chases him. Or did he already have the axe? I don't know. Fills the beans. An accident. I didn't want to get hurt. Haha, <laughs> okay. Okay, so basically. Travis, put down the axe. An accident. I didn't want her to get hurt. Oh, so sick. You know, since Ethan found that room. Mm-hmm. Okay, this fits. Where's Ethan? God damn it. Talk to me. Okay, okay. He wants to burn Vendigris' room. Look, Travis, just... Just, just leave me alone! Oh, God. Oh, 
Apocalypse never chooses vessels. You know that? To enact his wishes, he chose Mom. He chose me. He chose poorly. Son, I don't want to hurt you. You think scissors are going to save you? Yes. Okay. I thought it was Dale that was lying dead. He could have helped the sleeper. Helped us. Mom's right. You're a coward. And you'll be meeting Ethan again soon. Okay, this is rather tragic. Where is he going? He's going outside. Need to hurry up. Okay, into the old building there. Oh, the doors are open now. Okay, good. So he tries to dissuade his brother. Okay. This sleeper is feeding on them. Their hate and his trust. Ethan's father figured suicide wouldn't feed it. And it did. I could feel it sitting somewhere out there. That is a bullfrog. I just did. Okay. I don't know, I can't remember, but I don't think that it, it is. Okay. jumping in this game unfortunately but there might be something I can do to lower the water's level by uh, I think oh these, these are locked oh here Okay, I kind of stopped it. How did I get in here if this was already locked? Okay, never mind. <laughs> I'll just go ahead and accept it. I should be able to move across the river here now. There we go. Let's follow this path here. Oh my god, this still remains one of the most beautiful games I've ever actually seen. It's just way too beautiful. Ethan was close. 
I could feel it. The pinprick of light in the darkness. He would know me. He would know why I'd come. Would he? Really, Paul? Okay. Let's take a look at this. Oh my god. This is just amazing. And even the water. <laughs> well done. Well done, astronauts. Well done. I know I'm running way too fast, but... Ooh, okay, this is the burnt Van de Griff house. And it's still red. Meaning, it must have burnt... Yeah, this seems to be rather fresh here. Amongst the rubble I stood. Okay, it spells out the name. G A S A. Hmm. There must be some clue. In here. And <laughs> it's really dusty. <laughs> okay. Is there something here? I don't think there is. Wait, what's this? Okay. A pedestal. The lines give something away. They look into two different directions. Okay. There's nothing here. Okay. Good, 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 good. Must be some sort of clue here. Let's grab some distance. Two lion heads looking into the distance onto a beautiful lake. God! And we have a rotating ball which could spell out a name or a word. Oh, I see. Hmm. A C G A C O S B. I don't know. Oh, hang on. Cordy... Cordis. Cordif. Cordis. Cordus. I don't know. Is it Cordus? I don't know. Gordus. C 
Corvus. I see. And to be honest, that's just a wild guess. Ooh, okay. This is really burnt down here. Hang on. Charred. Easy? Peaceful? He was burned alive. Okay, three clues. Trying to open a door. table okay yeah, let's try this Diary. He said for the sleeper to wake up, Okay, wrong. Wrong chronology. Okay, this one should be coming at the end, basically. Protecting me from it. Ethan, I can help you. I found Vanderbilt's diary. He said for the sleeper to wake up, someone has to suffer. Look! Oh, I see. When I found that room, I didn't wake him up. He's trying to wake up now. Vanderbilt kept his victims alive. He made them suffer. That's what the sleeper wants. We need to get in that room. Really? Do we? I can squeeze through. Okay, and there the goes. Room won't matter, Ethan. The sleeper's inside us now. Grandpa, get back! We all have to die. Even you, even me. Oh, that's too bad, Grandpa. Prospero? 
Are you really here? I'm sorry, Ethel. I was late. Too late. You're right. You were too late. Okay. Here. Again. I knew this story. And it was Ethan's as much as it was mine. And it wasn't finished. Not yet. It's the whole map. It's everything we've encountered. Yeah, Ethan made us all up. That's awesome. That's me. Christ, Ethan. You're in here again? They missed dinner. Mom and Dad are pissed. They've been looking all over the place. Get out of here, Travis. Leave me alone. <laughs> hey, Ma! He's in here! Honey, be careful with that lamp. Damn. What the hell's wrong with your kid? Painting on walls, writing his stories. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck? Ethan! Sick. You missed dinner! I'm sorry. I've been working on a story all day. How long have I been out here? The Adventures of Paul Prospero, Supernatural Detective. Where do you get this stuff? Pop, would you get Travis out of here, please? He draws pictures on walls. What the hell is that? Chad? Shut up! You got yourself a faggot for a son, Dale. Travis. Oh, come on, don't go. be so hard on him. Come on. Faggot! <coughs> You're a fucking faggot! Travis, stop it! Oh! oh shit! Shit! Everyone! Go! Get out! Get out! The smoke, it's toxic! Oh Ooh. god! What do we do? What do we do? Yeah, that's how Ethan met his end. <coughs> <laughs> Remember, kid. That's too bad. I wrote about you, but I don't know if I created you. You made me real. I can't go yet. I have to finish my story about you. I wrote stories about everyone. I know you did, but my story's done, and it's a fine story. I can let go? You can let go. What happens then? Another story, kid. What else? Yeah, they were desperately trying to stop the fire from spreading.
Okay guys, I'll just let the credits roll. Thank you for watching. This has been The Vanishing of Ethan Carter. And after this I'll be going for a short break and we'll be returning with Dead by Daylight. <laughs>